it's pretty big. We were told it's about 75 feet. Okay, we're walking up the stairs. The yeah, actual bigger platform. Maybe the most intimidating scene ever. We have a crazy video this week. We are flying to Aspen, Colorado to go hit the X Games jump, which is gonna be horrifying and insane. But before we get into it, I wanna show you guys these fleece beanies. We have been sewing these and wearing them for ourselves the past year, and we love them. And you guys have been going crazy in the comments asking us to sell them again. So we are gonna create a custom batch for you guys. When you go order these hats, we're gonna sew it here in Oregon and ship it to you. It might take us a few weeks, but be patient because these are super detailed. We have these crazy embroideries. This one's like 11 inches long across the whole hat. We have these two cool S's on these guys and we have to embroider the fabric then sew the entire hat together and you have to get the placement perfect so it's really detailed and they're insanely high quality. Also, I can't forget, we have this dope brimmed beanie kind of bringing back the Britney Spears Y2K vibe. I think it's insanely cool. I've been wearing it all week. It's actually really functional too because it has a brim and it's a beanie. It has this sweet purple embroidered sickos right on the back or the front, depending on how you want to wear it. Your guys' support helps us make these videos. Every single hat you buy, we're gonna put a hand side note from one of us, a sticker and a cool little card. We really couldn't do it without you. We'll see you now. We are at X Games Aspen 2024 and they're letting us hit the course. They closed it off for us. We're gonna be hitting it with an athlete and our whole goal is to hit the big air jumps as well as all the other events, but the big air one is like real deal stuff. It is a huge jump, one of the biggest in the world. And uh, yeah, we're gonna hopefully follow a pro in and try and survive. X Games was nice enough to invite us out and give us kind of the whole experience. So we're gonna be ripping the park, we're gonna be going to the events, we're gonna be partying after. That's gonna be all in this episode. But first, we're gonna meet up with a snowboarder that I think a lot of you guys might know. He's standing right behind me and we're gonna go rip buttermilk with him right now. Here we go. What's up, Dev? How are you doing, man? Good to see you, dude. Oh, what size foot are you? I'm 10. I wear 10 boots. Oh, perfect. What about you? I wear uh, 11. Okay. But these bindings will fit you perfectly. You're gonna have to try my board, dog. Dude, could I? Yeah. Yo, no there we way, go. Dude. Yeah, we're both goofy, too. <laughs> yeah, we're both goofy. That would Let's go. So Forrest could try Zeb's board out. That would be fucking that awesome. That would be super psyched. You know what I call this thing? Or what? The way I explain it is it's like a Cadillac without power steering. <laughs> Will you define what you mean by that? Because I have my own imagination going. It's super fast. And if you can handle it, like, it will, like, it turns amazing. And, like, you can do whatever you want with it. Like, literally whatever. But you just have to put the power into it. And okay. Be right back out. <laughs> It's super stick. Fast money. Push the start money. Lost money. Oh, 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 oh,
<laughs> slope style ramp <laughs> to enter the course. Thing, yeah. Look at us right now. We're like a bunch of Skittles just <laughs> yeah, We look like a homeless pack of Skittles, dude. Oh my god. We're at the top of the slope style course. That's where everyone drops them. And these are the first set of rails. So we're watching these guys hit up. Oh, check it out. Oh. Should we go down to the second set? Yeah, let's do it. Oh my god. Oh. Here goes third set of rails. Check it out. So this setup's pretty sick. As you can see, they're all pretty gnarly. Like, everything's close together so that you can hop from one to the next. How's the bike track? That's yeah. so sick. Well, here comes the fourth set of rails. Look at how big this is. I wish we had someone for perspective standing next to that. It's as tall as we are. Okay, so those are all the rails on slope, and now the next thing that they hit is this insane fin, which is so gnarly. Look, here it is. Oh my god. All right, let's this go check so that out. Sick. <laughs> There's the fin. This is not mellow. Ready? Yo, this is so sketchy. <laughs> Guys, no one's talking about the fact that on a normal park, if you like slide off a rail, it's like smaller than your nuts. But if you were to nut that yeah. rainbow rail, it would yeah. actually rip you in half. <laughs> it's like eight feet tall. Imagine someone just hitting their nuts on it. We might actually do that if we try to hit it. And now we're gonna go check out the first normal jump. Yeah. Oh yeah. my yeah. god. Yeah. It's yeah. Not small. I don't got a reason to lie. They gave me the key to the sky. But I'd rather open my eyes. This is big. The scary thing too that you can't really see, it's not very soft snow. Not at all, dude. If you crash, it's gonna hurt. Jesus. Okay, so this is like the first normal jump on the slope course, and then there's just one more huge one, which is also the big air jump. Jesus. Oh. This is the last jump of the slope style course, and it is significantly bigger than any of the other jumps. Look at Gubu for reference here. Oh my god. <laughs> here we go, watch how big we go. Ready? <laughs> oh, dude. It's huge. Our plan was to watch Jake go through the whole park, and then we were gonna try it. And I genuinely don't know if I got that. I think each individual feature I could do alone, but the fact that they're all back to back is insane. Good to see you. Hey, yeah. Jake. There he is. What a Jake. What's up? Hey. Hey, dude. Hey, dude. How are you doing? We're ready. All right, guys, this is Jake. He's going to give us a run through throughout Slope Style. Hey, what's up? Jake Hanner. We're here at X Games 2024. I'm about to show these guys what it's like going through the course. It's happening very fast. We've maybe taken two runs, and now we're about to hit the X Games slope course, which <laughs> Justin, is sweet. Justin Jake. Yes. Trust Best guy to trust. To be up here. <laughs> no, <laughs> don't say that, dude. I'm, I'm putting my whole life in your hands right now. I'm putting my life in your hands, dude. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, you're you know. following Jake. I'm following <laughs> Forrest, guys. So Forrest is following Jake, which is sweet. Then I'm following Forrest. So Forrest makes a mistake. I'm right there with him. I've never hit jump this big. Jake, one of my favorite snowboarders, is going to show me how to do it. Thank you. Um, definitely feeling a little shaky, but... <laughs> the nurse is goofy, dude. I just imagine, you that, have you seen that one shot? I think it's a chick hitting one of the rails here. No! Catching, no, no, no. <laughs> catching her head Let's not have that thought. It's so funny. The only thing you need right now? What? Think about how crazy it's going to feel in the end. Yeah, it's okay. Great. Yeah, you're right. You know? How stoked I'll be if I land it. Okay. You know? So you've come through. You gotta through. embrace it. You're right, you're right, Jake. Caverns old, we must away a break of day. Are you ready for us? I'm trusting you with my life right now. Yeah, I see it, folks. I'm like, let's do two, like, star, uh, star, 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 star spangled. Just deep breath, deep breath. Ready? Deep breath. Goo Boo? Yeah, it's all me. Am I rolling? Yeah, you're rolling. Are you blinking? I'm blinking. Ready? Ready, boys. X Games Aspen course, here we go. Six 
Gosh. That was so cool, man. That was a once in a lifetime experience. I can't believe after hitting those rails and that jump to even do anything out of those rails. The fact yeah. that these guys are doing fours on, fours off, which is like a full spin on, full spin off on every single rail and hitting the gnarlier ones to us, then hitting three jumps is so mind boggling. Like, that's so insane. We've been skiing our whole yeah. life and that was horrifying that was to go straight insane. and jump off early. So, like, what they're doing is actually once you do this, 10 times gnarlier oh, feeling, dude. Now that we did the first one, the might, second might jump at the slope saw course is also the big air jump, so we're gonna follow our friend Hunter Hess from that upper kind of deck, skipping the whole course straight into this jump, which is almost gnarlier because you don't have the whole flow going, no. it's just one and done, but. Yeah, this jump. guy's about to show us how it's, how so it's here's done. someone hitting Watch this, this jump for me. Oh my God, <laughs> Alright you guys, the time has come for the big air jump. We're about to meet up with Hunter Hess, he's going to be our coach for this whole process. This jump is like, we were told it's about 75 feet and then bigger if you take it bigger than that. So that's definitely the biggest jump that I've ever had. This is kind of like the most iconic thing in X Games right now. It's actually insane that they're letting us try it. It's like the biggest jump at the biggest ski competition in the world. Yes. The other scary thing is about every single pro skier you could ever hear of is standing at the bottom one. <laughs> Here's our coach. Hunter! Hi! Hey, Hunter. Okay, Hunter, introduce Hi. yourself to the camera. Hi, my name's Hunter. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, guys, our coach for the big air jump is Hunter Hess. He's a professional pipe skier, but professional all around skier. He's super gnarly. And uh, he's actually competing in pipe, but he's going to be our big air coach, which is kind of a weird. <laughs> kind of a weird dynamic, but no, no. he's still gonna he's still gonna nail it. These guys are gonna kill it on the yeah, jump. Yeah. Or kill it or kill. Or be one of yeah. the two. One of, one of the two. Either way it's gonna be a great video. You guys are gonna be dying. We might eat shit, and at this point that's kinda where we're at. If you, you got a lot to work through, yes. so if one gets bodied, you got another. Dude, talk, oh, talk about I um, got a mustache. Yeah, talk about his physique a little bit more. I don't mind. He's got that. a Aquilus. kind of a slim thick pug, <laughs> you know? That's Busty. the worst way anyone's With described. He's got a pillar on that upper one. <laughs> if any girls want to call me, particularly oh Spanish God. ones, I'm, Yo, I'm in oh, any shitty we'll ski that. town. What do you think, Hunter? Yeah. Actually, like, I die. You guys are making me look so short. Uh, no, you'll be fine. Let's chill. I mean, I. Yeah. I heard it. I heard this is big, but I don't think it'll be like a oh, god big. Oh, that's right. You haven't <laughs> hit it yet. No, I haven't hit it. So this oh, will be so new for all. Oh, <laughs> just a random dude. We <laughs> just saw him grab him. Found this guy in Aspen. He's singing songs on the side of the road. <laughs> I'm not good at speed on jumps. I ride oh. too much pipe, so it kind of fucks up. Our coach is really <laughs> falling apart here. But you guys are gonna be fine. No, I think god. we'll all be in it together. We'll just all be in it together. <laughs> We walked up here, and it looks like we're going right into it. One first? No, we should just go. Okay. Really? Yeah. If you guys want. Okay. I mean, might as well. Might as well. <laughs> just gonna go for it, falling hunter. Come up, not fully short, but go for it. Here we go. All right, we're just going. Yeah. All right, getting up here, and we're just going. Yeah. Uh, and then an S would be good. No, don't scrub speed. Just an S probably would be good. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna have a hard time getting in with you guys. Uh. Whew, we're just going. Uh, did someone call Mac? Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Uh -huh. Yeah, boys. Yeah. Woo, scary, dude. Yeah. Three, two, one, boys. Get it.
my god, it's so fun though. Dude, I was rolling down the windows the whole time. That's what it all said. Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah. The jump's insanely big. I can't imagine doing like three flips off that. The crazy stuff these guys do. It's insane. It's the motherfucking X Games and it's the sickos. So you look like the scariest guy. Right now we're on the men's half pipe. We're up on the side. It's really steep getting up here. That's why I'm so out of breath. But anyway, men's ski half pipe going down. We're super stoked. It's like a new ACL. Oh yeah, look at that knee. Holy shit. That was your X Games right there. That was X Games. <laughs> I'm f***ing beat. Hunter is going right now in the so super pipe. I'm really excited about this because Hunter's just honestly like the best dude yeah, man, ever. He's insanely, insanely talented. Like this probably one of the best pipe skiers in the world. Down. He's like literally the first person to do a triple in the bike. And he's never won an X Games before. And he's kind of an underdog. And I kind of just have a feeling this is his year. So if he wins, it's going to be like so hype. Let's freaking go, Hunter. Hunter's got a really cool run going this season. He's been training some new tricks that are really unique. It's the final hit on the skier's right side wall where I've seen him do a misty five. It's a very unnatural rotation and while it might be a small degree of spin, it is one of the most beautiful tricks to watch. So we'll see if he can put that one down for me. Uh, yeah. Looks like he's ready to go. Here we go with Hunter Hess. Hunter spends a ton of time in the streets and in the backcountry. Check out Magma 3 for some of the latest video creation. Look at that switch hit corked out on that first one. Right side switch. There's the double cork. So finally getting those massive, super technical rotations. The right side double. No, and then he has problems at the bottom of the wall there as well. Holy shit, it's on so fast. I'll take that back. It's a carve back wall to wall into a final 16 And he hangs on with the squad at the bottom. It's the switch 900. Then the switch double. I'm rooting for him here. This is it. So we move on to Hunter Hess down kind of in the bottom of the pack there and found himself sitting in the metal position. He jumped up to I said it at the top of the contest. His best finishing super five is six back in 2022. He's looking at a potential medal out here tonight. And with one more run to go. This is Hunter Hess. Okay, Hunter has brand new trick for him out here tonight. That switch down the pipe, nine all stalled out. The double court's coming now. Left him here, so we're going to have the trouble in round one. Gets it. Can he put down the misty on the final hit? It's gigantic. Okay, now we're waiting on the rest of the guys to get their run to see if Hunter stays in second or if someone does really good and bumps him down. Hunter now just has to watch everybody go and try not to land it. And he, just, and he just said he was nauseous, he can't even watch. He's just like this, then he's like, and then he just saw the score. He's like, Here he goes. <laughs> And Hunter Hess, your one, two, three. Yeah, wait till the end. Can I get a hand? Yeah, this is. 
This is the last guy in the last run, Nate. And Hunter is in third place, so this is the last guy that can knock him out of a podium spot. So we're really hoping that Hunter can hold on to the podium. So he's happy on the shore when it's done. Yeah, yeah. So Here we go. Third and final run. Here he comes, David Wise. Here we go. David Wise needs this first hit. It's the most important part of his run. Hunter is like worked so hard for this this year. He's just podium, podium, podium. To see that story unfold after all the stuff we've seen him do is so sick, man. He's just taking a moment, was just looking up at the pipe, and I'm just like, damn, that's cool.